Riot police have been out in full force in Iran Wednesday, firing tear gas and bullets as they clash with protesters who converge near the country's parliament building. The Associated Press, along with all international news organizations, has been barred from reporting on the streets and as such must rely on witness accounts. Those witnesses tell us that security forces seized upon a small group of protesters demanding new presidential elections, beating them with batons. There have been more and more security forces on the streets in the past few days determined to squash any protest that pops up. So far, they've been able to prevent a rerun of demonstrations like this one in the days just after the controversial election. The wife of opposition leader Mir Hossein Mousavi is comparing the situation to martial law and says the protesters will not buckle under the situation. Still, the country's supreme leader has closed the door to any compromise, and President Mahmoud Ahmadinejad is set to be sworn in for his second term, either in late July or early August. Diane Kepley, The Associated Press.